2023 Volkswagen Taos. Pros. New standard active safety features. Forward model spacious cargo area. Good AWD highway fuel economy. Cons. Forgettable driving dynamics. Can get expensive. Volkswagen's entry-level SUV was new for 2022 and has quickly become one of the German brand's best-selling models. For 2023, the Taos picks up new content for every trim level. The Taos slots below the Tiguan and VW's SUV lineup and competes in a packed subcompact SUV class against the Honda HR-V and Kia Seltos, among many others. With a quickness, Volkswagen addressed one of our main gripes about the Taos for its second model year by adding more active safety features. We're fans of the little SUV because of its capacious cabin and class above materials in select areas. Its suspension is tuned for comfort and compliance, but with the dual-clutch transmission the SUV was clunky off the line. Plus, it can get expensive, which is a bigger deal in an entry-level segment with tons of other options. The best version of the crossover might be the forward model, which offers snappy acceleration, barely noticeable turbo lag, smooth upshifts, and quick downshifts. Like most Jetta sedans, the 2023 Taos is equipped with a standard 1.5-liter turbocharged inline-four that makes 158 horsepower and 184 pounds to foot of torque. Front-wheel drive Taos employ an 8-speed automatic, and all-wheel drive models get a 7-speed dual-clutch automatic. As of this writing, the EPA has estimates only for the 2023 Taos with AWD, which gets 25-30 seconds of a mile per gallon city-slash-highway. The 2022 Taos Forward was rated at 28 36 of a mile per gallon, and we don't expect that to change much for 2023. AWD fuel economy compares favorably to the 2023 Kia Seltos AWD with its slightly larger Turbo 4, which sees 25 thirtieths of a mile per gallon. The Seltos Forward uses a 2.0-liter naturally aspirated inline 4 that's about as efficient as the Taos Forward's Turbo 4, at 29 35 of a mile per gallon. IQ Drive Active Safety Features become standard on the Taos for 2023. Previously standard only on the cell top trim, the suite includes a lane keeping system, adaptive cruise control, and automatic emergency braking, as well as blind spot and rear cross traffic monitoring. Features like rear parking sensors, traffic sign recognition, and adaptive high beams are still exclusive to the top model. There is a significant difference in cargo space between front and all-wheel drive 2023 Taos because of the AWD model's additional drivetrain components. Competitors like 2023 Honda HR-V and 2023 Kia Seltos have a bit more front leg room but the Taos Forward offers the most cargo space. Stick with the 2023 Taos S base model and you'll get automatic LED headlights and rear LED lighting, a push-button start, and 8.0-inch digital cluster. Moving up to the SE trim level, the crossover's infotainment touchscreen grows from 6.5 inches to 8.0 inches, four speakers become six, and wireless instead of wired app connect facilitates Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility. The SE also gets standard wireless charging, keyless entry, remote start, and heated front seats, also available on the Taos SAWD, with an 8-way powered driver's seat. A panoramic sunroof is now standard on the 2023 Taos cell, joining features like the model's exterior cornering lights, front light bar, and rain-sensing wipers. The top model also receives a standard heated steering wheel, auto-dimming rear-view mirror, 10.3-inch digital cluster, and 8 speakers.